Hi, I am Sergos Alnes Kefalidis, one of the core developers of XFC, and in this video I will show you what I've been working on lately for Thuner. Um, I haven't uploaded a video in a while because I was focusing on uh, finishing my undergraduate thesis. Uh, luckily, that's done, so I am starting to work on XFC a bit more. Uh, so let's just jump right into it, shall we? Um, the first thing on our list is an image preview for Thunar. Uh, keep in mind that everything that I'm going to show you is a work in progress, and these are all the only the things that I've been working on. Um, XFC took part in Google Summer of Code this summer, so we have a lot of exciting things to show you, both for Thunar, XFC Terminal, other applications, but in this video I will show you what I've been working on lately. And uh, the first thing so is the image preview, which you can open like this and then you select an image, like this clown, and there you have it. Uh, since it's a work in progress, it doesn't have that much information here, but you can resize it, and there's some information. Now, the more interesting thing is that if you don't want a separate pane for your image preview, um, we have the embedded, embedded image preview, which is right there. So it resizes automatically. Uh, originally, um, we were split on whether we wanted this one or the other type of preview, so we decided to implement both. Uh, so there is that. Uh, it works, it's okay, and if you don't use it here, it uh, automatically disappears. Um, now, for the next thing on the agenda, I will have to close Tuner and change brand to check out settings, I believe. Uh, yes and let me build that real quick um, so how have you guys been <laughs> um, if you have if you don't know um, xfc 4.18 uh, is coming later this year or early next year so you can look forward to that i guess <laughs> uh, you can see our roadmap in our website uh, fly <laughs> okay let me open sooner and now we have a new tab in the preferences which includes all the preferences that are hidden right now at Thunar. The goal is to remove hidden preferences both for Thunar and XFC terminal and have every preference be editable through the user interface. So if we have like preferences that we don't know where to place them or that we consider secondary, uh, we used to make them to hide them, uh, which is a terrible user experience. <laughs> so uh, now you can just like uh, edit this. So uh, split view. This is the vertical split pane, but you can change it to the horizontal one like that. Uh, and that's it, I believe. These are two nice improvements in my opinion. Um, I will share some XFC terminal things soon, relatively. Uh, when I find the time to record another video for XFC Terminal. Um, and I will also write the, an overview uh, post about the contributions of my Google Summer of Code contributor, unless he decides to write one himself. Uh, until next time, I was Segas Anes Kefalidis, and this was one, I, I don't know what I'm calling these videos, a sooner development update. Bye bye!